Today I am testing homeowner battery cordless drills. Yes, this is an Amazon bestseller, an Amazon choice test. And I have a Bosch and a Black & Decker drill. So let's find out if you should have an Amazon bestseller or an Amazon choice. We're Machinery Nation, let's crack on. Tested by Machinery Nation. I'm gonna test them in wood, metal, and brick. See how they perform as a screwdriver and check out their features and benefits. The Amazon Choice is a Black & Decker BCD 700 S1K. It's 18 volt, has 40 Newton meters of torque, two speed settings, a hammer action, comes with one battery and a charger and costs us 45 pounds, 99 pence. The Amazon bestseller is a Bosch PSB 1800 Li-2. It's also 18 volt, but only has 38 Newton meters of torque. Two speed settings, has hammer and screw actions, comes with two batteries and a charger and cost us 85 pounds. This drill is also part of the Power All Alliance. More about that later. Let's get on with the first test. Hello darkness, my old friend. Right, so first test is drilling through some wood and I've got this half inch or 13 millimeter drill bit, which we're gonna do six holes each per drill through this inch thick or 25.4 millimeters bit of plywood to see how quickly you can drill six holes with the Black & Decker at first and then the Bosch. Let's see which is quickest. Let's do the test. Three, two, one, go. Now time for the Bosch. See what it's like. All right, drill, speed two. Let's go. Three, two, one, go. So they can both drill wood, let's see if they can drill metal. Now two brand new four millimeter drill bits, three holes each, let's see how they get on. Right, Black & Decker up first, let's go. Three, two, one, go. Yeah! Three, two, one, three. <laughs> the brick test, yes, masonry test. We're gonna put them both into hammer action and we've got two brand new 5.5 mil masonry bits in. Let's do some drilling. We're gonna do three holes each in each brick. Let's do it. Three, two, one, drill! Oh, oh come on down, well. Just come on down. Ah, uh, true test. Yeah. <laughs> 
as they whiz through that, we're going to put a 10 mil masonry bit in. I've only got one, so they've got to share one hole each. See if they can drill a 10 mil hole. Ah, oh, this is going to be fun. <laughs> Black and Decker up first. Let's do it. Three, two, one, drill. Uh oh. Didn't say good thing. coming undone. Ah, oh, there she is. Yeah! Time to notch with the bush! Three, two, one, drill! Right, so we all love the drilling, but we also love some screwing. And in this test, I've got three big screws and ten little screws. So first of all, we're going to put them up against each other for ten little screws, see which one is quickest. And then we're going to do three big screws. Black & Decker up first. Let's crack on. So the Black & Decker doesn't have a screwing mode, so we're going to put it to torque setting number 10, the highest torque setting they've got. If that isn't enough, then I'll turn it up to the drill setting mode. 10 should be plenty. Plenty, sir. Three, two, one, drill! Ah, this chuck is fun. We'll call it fun. Ah, nothing is strange, nothing is. I could yeah, pick one up while screw it in, like, there we go. That was harder than I thought it was going to be. Three, two, one, drill! Oh, buried that one. Ah. I'm going to screw this up. <laughs> smooth. That's too smooth. Oh. Ah, that was a bit. That's a drill spot. That'll smoother, definitely. I'm getting good at this. Right, time for three big screws. Three big screws. Black and Dagger! Three, two, one, drill! Oh, I'm gonna put it in drill. Oh, no, not quite. Let's go for another one. No, no more than that one. Go again. Oh, it's starting to smoke. No, the drill is literally starting to smoke. Can you see that? Can you see that? It doesn't like that very much. Can you see how much it smokes? No. Ah. Good old brushed motors, eh? Right. At least that time the chuck didn't come undone. Or does it melt with itself together? Jesus, wow. Ow. Gah! No, I think I've melted the chuck to itself. Perhaps I've done that too tight this time. Ah! That's a shame. I like that extension. Gah, there she is. Whew. Yeah, more grip fingers. Boshy time. Is it going to smoke? Is it? I don't know. Right, send it. Three, two, one, drill! Well, that's on screw. Now I'm going to be fair and put it on drill as well. No. Let's put it into setting one. Ah, she is. Ah, she is. We'll make it fair in a minute. We'll do setting one with the Black & Decker. Bosch is sending them home. Oh, yes, she is. She doesn't struggle. She's not getting hot like the other one. Nice. Right, let's just put setting one on the black and decker. It's only fair. That Bosch chuck is so much better than this thing. Ow. Right. Put it tight. Setting one. Nope. Nope. I'm going back to two. It doesn't, even, doesn't stay in setting one. Stay in setting one. I think I broke it. And it's all going around. 
I think the last time I used a Black & Decker, I was probably about 13 years old, helping my nan hang a curtain rail, put a curtain rail up. And I was hoping they'd come on leaps and bounds. Never mind. Put them setting one. It goes back to setting two. Setting one. Goes into setting two. Setting one. Goes into setting two. I think that noise says that, no, that's not going to do that. This is the thing, actually, get them out. Get the screws out of the holes. Ready? Ah, uh, just, just to chuck. Oh, and I've welded the chuck to hold it in setting one. Doesn't like setting one, obviously. Uh, hello? No. No, I'm just going to give up. I'll put it in the Bosch and see if the Bosch can get her out. Ha! Yeah! One. <laughs> I think that screw's bent. Never mind. Do we have a clear winner already? I don't know. Right, let's round it up. Now, do you think we should put this up against something else? Something a bit more necessary, probably powerful in it. Something that is designed to do better, like that. Yeah, Milwaukee M12. And you know, if you've watched our channel before, how much I love the M12 range. So, I think it's worth putting them up against each other in another video. So we're gonna do that. So I think we can honestly see that we've definitely got a true winner in this test. And if I was a DIYer, or homeowner, whatever it might be, then yeah, I would definitely consider this. Because it's nice and simple, it's got a nice chuck on it. We've seen it definitely does the job. And the battery slides in and out nice and easily on it. And to be fair, as I said at the beginning, this battery is part of the Power For All Alliance, it's called, which means not only will this battery fit Bosch products, it also fits a load of others, which I think is really, really interesting. So they've created this whole universe of battery products where these same batteries fit it. And there's gonna be more products on our channel that this battery fits. So I'm quite pleased it actually won this test. For the Black & Decker, okay, if you're only doing light work, basic, real basic work, then, then fine. For the sake of saving 40 quid compared to the Bosch, you get a drill that's gonna do some basic tasks. It's not gonna do any heavy stuff. And how long it's gonna last? Who knows? It only comes with one battery as well compared to two. The nice thing about two batteries is obviously you can charge one while using the other, so you've never got any downtime. Whereas when this runs out, you've got to literally stop what you're doing, wait for it to charge back up again. So the chuck on it, well, that's just that's just terrible. I think that should just be written off and put into a scrapyard and never seen again. The, the on and off, the, the speed setting control, you can't actually put it in speed one. So yeah, this one's gonna get sent back. Hopefully they're not, not all like that, but let us know in the comments if you've got any experience with either of these battery products, because we want to hear from you. Let us know in the bottom, or if you want to let us know which machine, or which tool we should put up against this one next. So I'm going to keep hold of it so we can use it in some other tests, and we'll go from there. But thank you very much for watching. We are Machinery Nation. We hope you enjoyed it. Please like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Cheerio.